welcome. I just came out of my doctor's appointment, my 28-week doctor's appointment. Actually, I've got to sit here for a little while and go back in because today was glucose test day, sugar test day, so I had to drink that lovely drink. And then I saw the doctor and I actually got done with plenty of time to spare. I got to sit here for about 20 more minutes before I go back in and finish up that test. But after that, I am going to, one, <laughs> go get me something to eat because I'm hungry, and two, go get my Walmart grocery pickup order. When I put in the order, I actually forgot that I had a doctor's appointment today, but it worked out. The time's going to work out good, me getting there to pick it up and everything. So glad that worked out. Uh, you know, I only got a few things going on in my mind and forgot I had a doctor's appointment today. We are officially on two week appointments. So that's exciting. I'll be back again in two weeks. All right, I'm going to sit here for a minute Go back in, get me something to eat, and then head to Walmart. I spent about $100 on groceries this week. I didn't have to get a lot of dinner stuff, and I actually had some snack stuff and everything left from last week, too. I did a bigger haul last week, so I used this opportunity to stock up on some things that we needed and get some things that we were out of, but you'll see all of that here shortly. <music> groceries are in here. I actually went and picked the kids up before I came home, so I've got them here with me too. I'm going to go ahead and show you. I actually made a quick trip to Dollar Tree. I'm going to show you what I got there, and then we'll take a look at this Walmart grocery pickup order. This is what I got at Dollar Tree. I went in to get some things to put in the kids' treasure box, and while I was in there, I got a few other things too, so... This is what I got for the treasure box. Just a few different things. They've already grabbed what they wanted for this week. Actually, Easton picked this, but he put it back up here for y'all to see it. It's a, a dinosaur notebook. And Audrey picked some Tic Tacs, and Huddy picked some Army Men. And then I just got a few other things to put in the treasure box so that once a week, they usually get to pick something as long as they had a good week. Got this little top, a few different crayons, a sticker book and some gum and my kids love bath bombs and shower fizzies so I got those to go in there as well they also had all of their spring stuff out and I've just been in a mood lately y'all I don't know if it's spring cleaning I don't know if it's nesting I don't know what it is but I've been cleaning this house inside and out and just getting it ready for warmer weather and springtime and so I grabbed a few things for outside these little stones, they matched. And this one says, look for angels in your life. They are everywhere. I loved that. So I got those, a hummingbird feeder. I thought this little wind chime was cute with this flower on it. We have a fairy garden outside the kids set up. So I got a couple of things to add to that, some little figurines. And how cute is that ice cream truck? We just needed some more of these. Oh, and... Dollar Tree had these things for garden flags. So I picked that up and then I ran in Walmart before I got my um, grocery pickup order and picked up a flag. I'll show you that in just a second. And they also had all their graduation stuff out. Huddy's graduating kindergarten this year. So I thought it'd be fun to do a little, little something. I uh, got a tablecloth, some grad glasses, some rubber duckies, and some plates. I went ahead and got it while they were there and in stock and not picked over. I'll just put it away for another month until school's done and he graduates kindergarten. Easton put this up here. He set it backwards. Let's spin it around. This is what I got at Walmart this week. So like I mentioned, I still had plenty of dinners. I actually had the tomato soup and grilled cheese stuff left. Chicken fingers and potato wedges. Chicken pot pie. 
the chicken tenderloins that I had gotten. I actually stuck those in the freezer too. So I still got all of that stuff for meals this week. And then I got the things for Hamburger Helper and also I got some sausage. I don't know if we'll do that for breakfast. Maybe we'll do breakfast for dinner. I don't know, but I got that as well. So that's kind of meal plan-ish for the week. The reason why I have two different things of water, you're going to see I stocked up on a few things for Justin to take and leave at his desk at work. And so this 12-pack of water is going to be going to his office with him. And then the 40-pack of water is for us to have here. Thought we would try the raspberry lemonade drink mix this week. Got some mini Dr. Peppers, some mini cream sodas, mellow yellows. Thought I would try the Equate shakes for Justin this week. I got the French vanilla ones. Somebody had mentioned that these were really good. I've been getting the Atkins ones, but we're going to let him give these a try this week. Some of our favorite iced coffee, the Mocha International Delight, and then just some like little K-cup things for the regular coffee maker. We got the Great Value Donut Shop this week. Got some Swiss rolls and some pecan spin wheels just to have to snack on. I have to put these up on the high shelf and have the kids ask for them. Otherwise, both of these boxes would be gone today. Who knows? I may clear out these boxes myself today. But anyway, got some of those and some mini muffins, the blueberry and strawberry mixed. I think this these are strawberry and these are blueberry. Y'all, I am so excited. I actually forgot that I put this on the order and when I was pulling everything out, I got really excited. I've seen Carla McKenzie talk about these. I've seen Jennifer at Southern Mama Drama talk about these. So guess what? I gotta try them. Got some of the soft baked cookies in the peanut butter and chocolatey drizzle. Kind of continuing on the snack kind of things. There's a pack of the great value variety chips back there, the small bags, and some chocolate chunk chewy granola bars. Some white sandwich bread and some plain bagels. And I was, for some reason, wanting bagels with the regular cream cheese, some everything bagel seasoning, And sliced avocado. So, got, got all the stuff for that. I also got a few bananas. We've not been eating bananas as much lately. But I still got a few so that we would have them. I got these mostly for Justin. He is the grapefruit person around here. And then got the kids some applesauce. Just original great value applesauce. These were a substitution. I had ordered the great value sweet peas. And they had to substitute for these, which is fine. And my plan is to mix these with the whole potatoes. Usually I do green beans and potatoes together, but the sweet peas and potatoes sounded good. So we're going to mix those and probably have it one night with this cheesy ranch burger hamburger helper and some crescent rolls. We were out of ketchup, so I got some more of that. I got all of the kids their favorite Lunchable. To have is an easy lunch one day as a matter of fact they may do that today and I had ordered two or three of these and there's only one so I'm gonna have to go back and check on that some ground beef for the hamburger helper and just a thing of sausage I don't know if I'll do sausage gravy we've still got the pancake mix that I got last week we may do the pancake mix and some sausage we shall see I got me a couple of different things of spicy Noodles is kimchi is one of my favorite. Got this one as well. And then also got Justin some things to leave in his desk at work or to have there. I still got some just regular chicken uh, Raymond noodle cups that I'm going to send with him. And I also got him the teriyaki chicken and the Mike's Mighty Good chicken. I also got him one of these right here. And a couple of things of tuna, a ranch, and then just a regular. This was a substitution. 
I hadn't ordered the reduced sodium, but they substituted it, so that's okay. Also got him some of these trail mix granola bars to take and leave at work and some of the fresh stack Ritz crackers. The rest is non-food. I'm gonna try out this Mr. Clean Clean Freak multi-surface cleaner this week. And see see what I think about it. I've never I've never tried this one before, so we're gonna give it a shot. I also needed some more body wash for myself. And then I got me and Justin both new bath sponges. These flowers need a little a little bit of love, but they are looking pretty and I think I'm gonna sit those on the front porch. So got those. I actually got those when I went in to get this little garden flag. Is that not the cutest thing with the flowers and the bees? This is welcome friends. So I'm gonna use that stand that I got at Dollar Tree and put this up by our steps on the front porch. This is the rug that I got for the front porch. And then I just got this plain brown one to go by the back door. Pretty sure I forgot to mention the bologna. <laughs> if I did, I got some thick sliced bologna for sandwiches this week. So that is our grocery haul, Walmart grocery pickup haul, and a little bonus Dollar Tree haul for you this week. I'm going to call the kids back in and have them help me put everything away. And I think I'll see if they want those Lunchables for lunch. Why not? We'll do a fun lunch today and an easy lunch for Mama. <laughs> so thank y'all for coming along. If you're not already subscribed, we do these things, these grocery hauls and meal plans and what's for dinners, all that kind of stuff around here every single week. So if it's something you enjoy, hit that subscribe button before you leave. We'd love to have you stick around. We love you guys, and we'll see you next time. Bye, y'all.